Hey everyone, LC Gamer, and welcome back to The Witch and the Hundred Knight. We're here on the world map because, well, after leaving the Tatara Desert, looking for water, which I couldn't find anything there, we head back here to South Tatara Desert, where there's supposed to be some sort of event. Okay, let's see. Let's check the map. Yeah, that's in a good location for me to find. Fairly easy. I'm gonna hit this up. Uh, warp to... Yeah, East Desert. There must be another jump point around here somewhere. But, I'm only here to progress the storyline just a little bit. Oh. The well. The hundred night fills water. This is your chance to obtain water. Cool. Um hundred day roll. Cookies. Excuse me. I need you to move. Water jar. I need you to move away. Go, go, shoot, shoot, shoot. No, no, no. Stop it. Thank you. Because I don't want to hit you. And, let me guess, that's a shop as well. Oh. Well, let's see. It's a farmhouse, not a shop. Uh, cookies. I will take the cookies. Do I have enough space for the cookies? Let's check. Come on. Yes, I have space for the cookies. Do I have enough space for the 100 day roll? That could be a problem if I don't. Oh well. Well, let's see, let's see. Map. Okay, now that I have the water jar, and it's full of water, I might as well do a bit of exploration to get the rest of this uh, filled out. Come on now. It's not that hard. Fish people! Go away. And yes, I did level up quite a bit to be able to take these guys on. Come on. Oh. Ooh. Spinning. Uh, I'll take this. And this. And there's a, uh chest I can't get because it's up on top of the uh, that up there which I can only get later after uh, an ability is unlocked I hate the fact I can't do some of this now but I'm not gonna complain too much Ooh, Earl's Lance now, I figured out how to upgrade the Tower of Illusion. 
And as the story progresses, it unlocks more to the tower. Nope, nope, stop it. Wow. Okay. Macho Hundred Knight. And that's another upgrade piece. Is there anything else out here? Anything worth collecting? You are in my way. Can I go down the well? No, I can't. Oh, it's worth trying. Ooh, hammer to the face. Ouch. One, two. One, two. And now we run along. One, two, three. Oh, I missed. You got him. Well, so far so good. There's a pillar. Come on. What does it... It says... Scared to death? Wow. He doesn't fool around when it comes to... Trying to get these guys. I'll just leave the desert now. Don't want to waste all my time here. Return to world map. I'll come back here in a little while and uh, finish exploring. Mm hmm. I need to upgrade the tower as quickly as I can, but. Not gonna happen anytime soon. Are you done? Guess not. Alright, from here we warp to the closest pillar to location. She's way out here. Now, I got most of this already filled out off screen, but it's still effective. Hey, little satyr. Water, please, just a drop. We have no other leads. Get him some water. Hundred night. And the water. Water jar has been lost. Thank you so much. Ah. Thank you, really. You saved my life. But we can't stay here. The sand eater will take notice. There I consume my sheep. Huh? Sand eater? Is that some kind of magic beast that lives in this area? It's dangerous here. I want to thank you, so please come visit our humble village. 
Chitara village can be accessed via a pathway only us villagers know. Please come with me. A village in the desert? Sounds annoying, but who knows? The bell plant could be there. And now he's prancing off. This way, please. If we are separated, please use the sound of my horn to guide you back to my side. An escort mission? Really? Remember the sound. Now then, let's go before the Sand Eater notices us. Hurry, hurry. Okay. Switch. And he's going to constantly be honking with his horn until I get to him. Would you be quiet? No wonder the Sin Eater is constantly trying to hunt you down. You make too much noise. Okay, I want to take that horn and show it where the sun don't shine if he keeps at it. I gotta go this way. Well, that's fine. Oh, he's really asking for it, though. To the, uh, oh, thank you. To the, uh, oh, there it is. Warp. There we go. The blackened pillar. It's probably been scorched to death by the sun. Okay, okay, enough out of you. Swaggling? The hell? Are you scared of something? Has called up something vicious. Hold on, there's something moving around underneath you. <laughs> Sand Eater. A Legend of Zelda ripoff. But, still a good boss fight. Um, <laughs> I see. That's the Sand Eater. It seems stronger than I thought. Since it makes the desert beast its prey, something of average strength can't hope to fight it. For whatever reason, it just completely ignored you. 
<laughs> Magic beings have no nourishing substance after all. Good. We're safe. We're almost there. Just a bit more. And he's gonna start his horn again. See, I knew it. But I'm gonna let him blow his horn for a little bit longer. I wanna see if this will actually blow up. Oh, it does. It does. What do we have here? Uh, stomach stone. Okay. And where? Oh, he's all the way over there. Oh, joy. No, no, no. You leave me alone. You leave me alone, too. Okay, you can stop the horn blowing. Again! And again! I'm about to club you. Thank you so much for your help. We've made it to my village. Yes, thanks for rescuing me. Rescuing me. Please come to my house. We'll prepare a delicious meal for you. I live in the village suburbs. I'll go on ahead and start cooking. Oh, finally he stopped blowing that horn. Huh? So this is what makes up a beastman's village. Somewhere nearby, nearby I can sense a pillar. I can't pinpoint it. They're always invisible, but I've always been able to figure out where they are before, so why now? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Search the village for a bit. Sure. Hidden Astaro. Hmm. We have here yeah. another cookie. I want the cookie. Thank you for the cookie. Here. Um, yeah, I'll take it. Thief one, thief two. So, the thief hideouts. Yep, yep, that's what they are. And over here we have a stairwell that leads down somewhere. Shall I take a look? Oh, I want to take a look. But if I take a look now, I won't have a chance to... ...see much of anything else. Will I? Yeah, no. I don't want to go down there. That's apparently the boss area. But, it has been marked. Uh... Yeah, I'll take it. Sand Eater Researcher. Hmm. A blue gem? Drunk old man. Did he put up a fight? Mm, not too much. Now then, where to look? Where to look? I know. I'll use my minion.
and get him to scout out for me. Looking for things important. Hmm, something important is back here. And that's the edge of the map. Okay. That was interesting. Really was. And now over here. Nope. Over here. We have a lone house. And that appears to be my destination. So. There are a few things here which says hostile. But. I haven't hurt anybody, so. Technically, I should be fine. Right? I've done nothing to you. I've done nothing to you, so leave me alone. Maybe it's my karma. And she's trying to throw rocks at me. Yay. Okay. And now they're upset with me. Really now? At least I'm not attacking you. I'm leaving you alone. Uh, so did I get it? Yes, I got it. The crunchy garlic. <laughs> Are you trying to antagonize me? It's not gonna work while I'm in the house. Oh, that was actually pretty funny. What are you going to do? You're going to shake your tail at me? Okay. Yeah, it's almost all complete except for that one spot off to that far side. to properly express my gratitude. Lana? He claimed he was going to go and become a witch three days ago. We were getting worried. How can we show our appreciation? We just sold off our sand sheep, so there's not much left here. Even if we try to help you, all we can do is read the stars, so this is the least we can do. Come and eat a meal with us. I'll make our village a special dish. Oh, just a moment. I'll call Lana to join us. Huh? This village is full of astrologists? Hmm. Well, I doubt you know what that means. So let me enlighten you. I know what an astrologist is, but... Hundred Knight doesn't seem to... realize what they are. Astrologists look at the position of the stars, record their movement, and tell fortunes based off that. Hmm, that's old school wide open plains or a desert, it's easy to get lost because there aren't any natural landmarks. That's why they read the stars to get a fix on their location. But if an astrologist gets himself lost, that's one hell of an embarrassing story to tell. A high level astrologist can even predict someone's future. 
But I think the one we saved is a laughable newbie. Just show them the damn letter so we can find the bell plant. Welcome to our home. I haven't introduced myself yet, have I? My name is Lana Nia Lucini. Lucini? Um, please, just call me Lucini. Huh? Tito? We have a visitor. Did it come here from the desert? What? Really? The sand eater was seen nearby. It may have found the village. Our village might get attacked soon. Why, if it isn't little Lana, you brought home a ridiculous problem this time. Why do you think we have to live in a backwater hellhole like this? Your damn husband, too. Your family is nothing but bad luck. L Lana, what's going on? Explain it to me, please. That. S Sand Eater! The Sand Eater is here! Run away! You cowards. Putting the blame all on these two? The Sand Eater? This is no time to stand idly by. Your mother needs to go now, Lana. Stay here with our guest. What? But, Mom! Relax. I won't let you die. No matter what. <sighs> Goodbye, Lana. Please live long enough to find your own happiness. Wait! Mom, wait! This way, Sand Eater. Go back to the desert where you belong. Come on, come on. Your dinner is right over here. I knew what that horn did attract him. It left. Jeez, every time we try to bring up the bell plant, we get interrupted by something. Hey, Hunter Knight, ask again. I get the feeling we'll have to do something about the sand eater. Okay. <laughs> A woman's intuition. I sense the movements of mana that's flowing through here. The pillar must be here, too. Search around the village. I, th I think something's hiding here. Well, before I do that, I'm gonna go back up here to the house. No, no, you, ow, no, leave me alone. Ooh, that was close. And... It sounds like someone is crying inside the house. It's okay, it's okay, everything will be fine. Okay, that's odd. Oh, there's at least one person still here that's not willing to skin me. Hmm. Hey, this well smells strange. Oh, I see. So there's no guarantee that a pillar is above ground, huh? Hmm. Pillar that doesn't exist, and a violent sand eater. Everything's connected. And tonight, we found our destination. The eye that peeps at us from the darkness. Stab it as soon as it looks at you. Jump in there, Hundred Knight. The Hundred Knight leaps into the well. And thumps to the ground. <laughs> Just as I thought. An underground chamber. I can sense the pillar. I can sense that creature's presence, too. Ooh. Come on out, you fat sand muncher. You just recently became the pillar's protector, haven't you? Does it think it's in at the top of the food chain or something? 
Let this bug get a taste of humble pie, Hundred Knight. Fill the pie with absolute despair. Ripe fear. Okay. I'm apparently more scared of it than it is of me. I need to switch to this. Are they effective? Look at this. Ow. Okay, so magic is the key. Oh. I can't have this. Stop moving your tail around. Come on. Come on. Enough out of you. Thank you. And it is down. Good thing I got myself leveled up. Trying to fight all these monsters at low level is difficult. And there's the pillar. Up in the corner of the room. It would have been more appropriate for it to be in the middle. <laughs> good job, Hundred Knight. It was sort of a side quest, but a good job all the same. You're welcome. Not bad. The swamp's pretty nice, right? Can you appreciate a swamp of this caliber yet? I have no idea what you're talking about. Swamp this, swamp that. Master, but uh, this dench has to be poisonous. But please, Witch Master, take me on as your apprentice. Huh? We heard you defeated the Sand Eater. We are in your debt. But I learned that my child Lana and the rest of the village was saved by a Witch Master. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart. Both the Witch Master of the Swamp and you, her faithful servant. Well, it was just a coincidence. There's nothing to thank us for. And the swamp spread under the village, too. I feel really good right now. How wonderful for you. I know it's sudden, Witch Master, but please, let me be your apprentice. Mmm, no. This again? What's with this sudden garbage, anyway? I don't have time to babysit little boys. I'm busy preparing for the Walt Pergus nighttime soiree, after all. W Walt Pergus? Amazing! So there really is an annual party. Huh? Uh, um, do you know Great Witch Malia? I heard she's a lovely woman. That Great Witch, huh? Thinking about that wicked hack of a witch makes me want to puke. Wow, that's so mean! And she was actually wicked? I'm so surprised right now. What about Thin Ice Lily? Is she as cool as Ice like rumored? Is she the most popular of all? And is Dustwitch Purple Peel as strong as they say? She can punch a hole in any wall without even using magic! <laughs> Gag him with something. Which Nazaria is said to be really quiet, but she's the leader of all the witches, right? How can you be a quiet leader? How does she give speeches? Maybe she just pantomimes it. You... you're interested in all those third-rate hacks? N not at all! Of course, the Great Swamp Witch is my number one. You say that now. I want to be the apprentice of the one who saved my life, my new master, Metalia. No, give up. Piss off. Don't make me repeat myself. Keep saying that, please. That's enough, Lana. You're troubling the witch master. 
I... I won't give up. I'll do anything, so please, make me your apprentice. I already said I don't got the time to babysit a child like you. I need to hurry up and find the bell plant. I know. I'll find the bell plant for you. What? You know where it is? Lana, don't say things you know nothing about. Huh? Explain yourself. I'm so sorry. The bell plant is a mysterious plant that responds to the emotions of whoever is nearby. It used to grow in this area, but now I believe it's all because the village was filled with fear. Due to the sand eaters, the bell plant grows from a seed within hours. But if it senses fear, it withers away instantly. Huh? So with the sand eater gone, shouldn't it start to grow again? Technically. Unfortunately, there is more than one sand eater out there. Oh. Joy. This one great witch helped us drive off all the sand eaters in the area. But now, since their numbers have grown, doing the same thing again may prove difficult. Unless we can make the people's fears vanish completely, the bell plant will never grow again. I see. No way! There's gotta be a way! Please, Witch Master, I'll find the bell plant for you. Just agree to take me on. I'm begging you, Witch Master. I still say no, but. Fine. When I come back tomorrow, I might consider it if you have a bell plant waiting for me. But not today. I've way too much business to take care of. R really? I'm so grateful. I'll definitely find a bell plant. Let's go home, Hundred Knight. I'm curious what the dog and that idiot butler are up to. Okay. Oh. That was interesting. Unfortunately, it was also a little unnerving. Still nothing? No need for me to get antsy, I guess. I should be ready tomorrow morning. I should be ready by tomorrow morning. The following morning... So late. Those two haven't come back yet. They better not have turned into rotten... rotting corpses without my permission. And what... what are they up to? I need to create a... Pr protective charm as soon as possible. Hey, Hundred Knight, go find those worthless slackers. Alright, oratize Arlecchino first, because I'm hungry. He was acting so confident, what happened to him? He went off to that dead forest. Now I'm sure you'll be able to spot him pretty easily. That dog went off to the Valentine Domain. I have no clue where. Will you find Arlecchino, I'll get a bearing on her position by using my dowsing pendulum. If you understand, hurry it up. Yes, ma'am. Now then, I'll leave it here for now, and we'll take on the search for Arlecchino and Visco in the next video. So until then, see you guys.